tenacity and the courage of one country, the country of Albania, they are now free. Let me welcome the delegation from Albania. And we will hear from that delegation. We will hear from Ilona Jibreya, Deputy Minister of Albania, from Pandeli Mashko, former Prime Minister of Albania, who is heading the delegation, and from Fatmir Mediu, former Defense Minister of Albania. Participants, dear honorable guests, dear Madame Rajavi, I would like first to greet our brother and sister that are in Albania and are watching you here. Hello. It's great honor for me to be this extraordinary event. The first time I was here was 2014. By that time, the government of Albania, with Prime Minister Edi Rama and the previous government, has accepted 250 persons. But in a two-year time, now we have 2,700 people living in Albania. It was a huge, huge operation with the support of our Prime Minister, an inspiring leader, with support of partners, that we made it. Yes, we made it. Would like no a single incident, safe and in a very organized matter. We welcomed our brother and sister, which are not a terrorist group, but are people that fight and work for a better democracy, for peace, they are fully integrated in Albania. They live in a free and democratic country, such as Albania, a country which has lived the most strongest dictatorship in Europe. Madame Rajavi's inspiring model that shows what an woman can do, what an woman can contribute for freedom and peace. There are so many people that would like to greet. I would like not to forget Hassan, the negotiator, that works day and night. I don't know if he never sleeps. <laughs> Albania, the Albanian government has welcomed, as I mentioned, 2,700 brother and sister, which are now living safe and uh, in a very democratic manner in Albania. And Albania has shown a very unique model, a, a, a model that has not been followed by many other countries. But this shows that even a poor country has a very open heart and can do everything with a heart. And the last... Okay. And the last thing, as George Washington has said, Liberty, when it begins to take roots, is a plant of rapid growth. And this is the work and the work that make people do. It is a rapid growth that will grow and grow and never stop. Thank you. I would like now to give the floor to the former Prime Minister and to the very supportive MEC uh, people. He is uh, Pandeli Maiko.